So this is a bunch of old Luzamel buffaloes. <laughs> Get a job. <laughs> <laughs> I resemble that. Really nice. Get a job. <laughs> No more sponging off the family. And obviously, it's a couple of hippos. Oh, wow. <laughs> now you have two, no one, di two different types left. of buffalo. Can you see the, you know, with the horns? Yeah. The bulls get into territorial fights. See the fights. way their horns are different? Oh, look and they, look at the damage they do. For the male and female? Oh, yep. Yeah. The, the male has big, broad horns, while right. the female horns are smaller. To get into territorial fights. The, the white bird under the buffalo there is a cato egret. Then there's another white bird behind them. That's a lito egret. Under the buffalo, cato egret. Further in the channel is a lito egret. So now I'm confused. You said they were both male buffalo. Yeah. Well, their horns are different. One is thicker than the other. The one on the right, their horns are thicker than the ones on the left. Yeah. One they looks cannot more re like a Dutch cap. Yeah, the they other. cannot really always be the same, but still, the one to the left, the horns are thicker than those, than, than, than those of the female would be. The ones of the males are all connected. They look connected, both of them, while the females, they have far in the middle, and they are smaller. So the one to the left still has bigger horns than the female would have. But they're both the same species? Yeah, they are the same species. Well, live and learn. I guess it's a female preference. Which type of horns do you like? And the one the one to the right, the buffalo to the right is older than the one to the left. Uh. Yeah. You can even see their size is different. The one is still bigger, and the one to the right is smaller. Yes. It's old and frail. Mm. <coughs> they and the hippos seem to get along all right, as long as everybody stays their distance. Yeah. They don't really mind each other. Do the, do the buffalo and the hippos ever fight at all? No, they don't. Um, no. I mean, it's more safety members than all grazers, so it's not like a predator and prey. But, uh, you know, the predators, you don't see them hanging around together because they need each other's competition. But the grazers... The grazers, they live. They all live in harmony. You'll find hippos, yeah. Um, yeah, buffaloes, giraffes, cobs, all together, and they won't bother each other. Because for them, food is not a problem. It's in plenty. Do they ever come up for the boats? The hippos? Yes, they do. What do you do? Move away? You, you just move away. If you stay there, they'll bump your boat. Maybe capsize if it's a, if it's a small boat. <laughs> but this one is big for a hippo to capsize. Okay. So 